This backhoe dumping gravel in Dorchester is powered only by electricity. It's made by a company called Veridi Parenti. It has a battery pack, which is the fuel tank, it has an electric motor directly underneath it. The difference is, is that pack and that engine have one moving part, right? the shaft at the end of that motor. The diesel engine had 3,000 moving parts. National Grid is leasing the backhoe. Our goals right now, as stated earlier, is to electrify 100% of our light duty vehicles uh, by 2030. Construction equipment isn't part of our 2030 goals right now, but when we see opportunities like this and a chance to be at the forefront of sustainability, we're definitely going to jump in and try to partner with anyone who can try to make a change. The initial purchase price on this will probably be twice what the diesel is. Um, you get that back within about three years. What is that? What's that number? Uh, you know, hypothetically, this machine today probably sells for $100,000. The electric will be close to two, but that differential over a three-year period, you get back an operating cost. The CEO of Veridi Parenti says the cost of charging a piece of equipment like this is a fraction of filling it with fuel. As far as how it runs, just ask one of the national grid operators. It's no different, except this is much quieter. Right now, National Grid is not taking this to emergency situations or jobs that they think will last longer than eight hours, the life of the battery. They're testing it out in the field. In Dorchester, Jennifer Egan, WCPB News Center 5.